Alrighty. So, Miley, what is your favorite class to teach and why? Do you favorite class? Mm -hmm. Oh gosh, I love teaching so many different classes. Mm -hmm. So, I think my it's not the format, it's mm -hmm. really it becomes a favorite class of mine when I get to know the members mm. and I get to hear their stories mm -hmm. about how um, their life has changed and I'm going to get oh, emotional yeah. even. <laughs> so I just, I feel so grateful when I can hear that right? mm -hmm. movement, whether it's yoga or Zumba mm -hmm. or, you know, the therapy balls or just learning how to breathe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that becomes what, her favorite class. What made you passionate about dance and teaching? So my mom had me and my sister in dance our whole life, mm -hmm. and that became, um, I think, part of my outlet, but I never really knew that until I went to college, I stopped moving, you know, we just kind of get into going to class, doing my work, going out with friends, and um, and my moods started to change, my mm -hmm. feelings about myself started to change, mm -hmm. and I rediscovered how important movement was for me. Because mm -hmm. growing up, I did jazz, tap, ballet, cheerleading. Um, I mean, you name it. It was, it was, it was always movement. Mm -hmm. And um, and I just, I'm, I'm lucky that my mom did that for us. Mm -hmm. And I'm lucky that I rediscovered it because mm -hmm. when I was in college, mm -hmm. I saw an aerobic class and I thought, I'm never going to do that. That's silly. It's ridiculous. <laughs> And then somehow I got into it, and then I became a certified aerobic instru instructor. So Same thing with yoga. Mm -hmm. First saw yoga, I thought, ooh, that's weird. I'm never going to try that. And then I tried it, and now, you know, 200 um, registered yoga teacher, 200 wow. hour, and I'm going for my 500 hour Yay. for a specialty in yoga psychology. Yo, congrats. Thank you. That's awesome. <laughs> you. That's a lot of hard work. It's hard work, and it's so much fun to learn. The body is amazing. Mm. Yeah. So, last question. Yes. Um, how has Group X impacted your workout journey? My workout journey. Mm -hmm. I think being a group, I mean, a Group X instructor, mm -hmm. or yeah. I think it's impacted me in that there's always something new to learn. There's always new formats, mm -hmm. and because the research mm -hmm. is is. In the industry, it's embedded in the formats. Mm -hmm. I get to learn more about how to mm -hmm. instruct verbally, how to mm -hmm. give the cueing, how to correct form. Yeah. Um, now we're into functional movement, right? Mm -hmm. and, and the journey with Group X has gone from, ah, kill your body, work your body, no pain, no gain, to now we understand that we need to learn different range of movement mm -hmm. and we want to work out in order to have that longevity mm. of ease of movement, mm -hmm. um, less pain, more confidence. Yeah. And then that keeps us um, living longer with more grace mm. and, yeah, and enjoyment.